Welcome, 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 welcome. All right, so this is day one, first one out of 15 that we're gonna go over and get you trained on everything beach body. So first things first, I'm super glad you're here. I really, 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 really am from the bottom of my heart. I think this business is incredible absolutely incredible and the opportunity to grow it into a six figure seven figure business all from your phone in the cracks of your day is completely 100 percent possible so before we go any farther i'm in my son's room um they're having piano practice in the majority of the house so it's kind of loud um and baby sleeping so nap time hustle all right so really quickly all of these videos i'm going to try to keep under five minutes so that you can get in and get out and watch them and learn and move on with your day. So today, the very first one is going to be about goals. All right. So I know people that don't have goals. My husband is one of them. Like he just doesn't believe in having goals. And in a split second, I kind of think that's okay. Sometimes when I set really big goals that um, I probably could not get to in one year and then I don't reach them. I get really discouraged. I'm like, oh my gosh. Okay. But on the practical sense of having a goal, it really kind of maps out where you want to be and what you envision your life to be like. So without getting into all of, you know, the nitty gritty, I just want you to stop for a second and think, think. Where do you want to be in five years? Where do you want to be in three years? Where do you want to be next year? How much money would you like to make by the end of this month? Would 300 bucks be cool? How about next month? Would 1500 bucks be cool? How about 3000? All of that is possible and it's all based upon helping people. But first, you got to know why you're doing this. What do you want out of this? Is it something that you just want because you want something of your own to to just be yours? I can resonate with that because that's what I wanted. My husband brought home the bread and butter and the bacon, and I didn't need a job. But I found myself constantly over the course of our then 14 years going, I just know I have it in me. I just know I have something in me of value that I could use for a business. Like I knew I had an entrepreneurial spirit within me that I knew just needed to get out of the box and blossom and grow. And so I want you to envision what do you want? Do you just want something that is yours, that you can call your own, you can stamp your name on it, and it could be something fun for you to like have a hobby about seeing if you can make it grow or not and seeing if you can learn these new skills. What do you want? Now, let's, let's think a little bit more dreamy. If money were no option and time were no option, where would you want to live? By who would you want to live? Who would you want to live with? Um, you know, for me, later on down the road, I'd love to take care of my mom. Um, my mom and dad are divorced. My dad is wealthy and is taking care of himself beautifully. And my mom, well, she's made some choices in her life. And, you know, I really want to be there for her to make the end of her life be as beautiful as possible. So that's something that is personal to me. But Along that, you know, I want to take my kids fun places and I want to be able to do things and go places on a whim just because I want to go. Okay, so those are specific to me. I want to hear what is specific to you. And there's no dream too grand to share because I have some really grand dreams that might make you giggle if I tell them to you right now. But this team is going places and you're a part of it now, so let's hear what you got. 